Back in 1880, a former slave from a Georgia plantation called Old Sam, his name's been lost to history. It was said that he was starting to do okay for himself. He'd been working about 30 acres of his own for a few years and was looking to buy 10 more. But this was post-Reconstruction era Georgia, and Jim Crow was the social and political reality. Old Sam was falsely accused of stealing chickens and tobacco seed, and worst of all, of talking to a white woman while looking her in the eye. A few nights later, five men in robes and burlap hoods kicked in his door and pulled him from his bed at gunpoint. He was whipped on a post, beaten, and kicked to near unconsciousness. It took five men to do this. They bound his hands and feet, doused him with lamp oil, and then burned him alive in a hayloft. That was more than 100 years ago but the ground could not hold his despair and anguish. It could not contain his stolen humanity. And so old Sam returned just a few weeks later to pay a call to five men, not in vengeance, but to collect a debt and in exacting justice. His ancestors and their gods have very, very long memories. <laughs> 